Hello, my darlings. As you can see, I'm in a little bit of a different outfit than usual. This is, um, my outfit that I'm putting together. Some of it is just stuff that I picked up today. I thought, well, that I picked up yesterday, and I thought that looked good today for this vlog that I'm doing. So, um, I'm going to show you off some of my stuff. As you can see, I'm wearing a camouflage bandana that I bought for 50 cents at the flea market down the street, down the street from where I live. Uh, same as this, this was 50 cents. Uh, the ring I've had for a long time and it's beginning to wear and has a, a barbed wire on it, see? Uh, the hat I picked up from Walmart. Uh, this is a thing that was left over at, in this house that uh, I liked and I wear it like a cravat. I've had this for a very long time. It is a uh, basically just a rope that I fixed to where it can tighten and you see I tie the knot there and then there's the knot on the other side right here as you can see and uh, I have my little pendant on it which is a skull. I had that ever since um, Panhandle. The shirt's new, and the bamboo's new, and this glove I just took in, cut up, and sewn back together. I'm still going to do some other little things on it. Um, the other day, I went and I watched Contagion, and uh, Abduction, but with Taylor Lochner in it. I didn't really like Abduction that much. It was an action movie, which was, which was pretty good. But I liked um, Contagion more. It was um, much more interesting, and it was a bit more science fiction. And I like science fiction and horror, so it was kind of a thriller, science fiction thriller. And uh, I just enjoyed it. It was a very good movie. I suggest going out and watching it if you haven't already watched it. Uh, Basically, it's about a disease that this woman contracts, and then she spreads to all, like, three other people, and by day 244, thousands have died, not only in America, but elsewhere out there. Um, abduction was okay. Like I said, it had Taylor Lochner in it. Uh, I would recommend it, but... You don't want to watch him take his shirt off every 15 minutes in the film. I wouldn't watch it. So, it might be a more enjoyable movie for girls, but it does have that action for the guys. Um, not much else, really. Uh, I don't want this to be completely short, but, um, uh, I got... I have a, I have someone now. She's a wonderful girl, and I like her. Uh, I'm going to meet her this Friday at the homecoming uh, game uh, at the ballpark. The ballpark. Uh, uh, right now, I'm watching uh, I Robot with Will Smith in it. It's okay. It's been a while since I've watched it. I like it. Um, I've been regularly checking on TV for anything related to God because I am deeply interested in, not because I'm obsessed with it. I'm obsessed with other things. So. Uh, but really, they don't have that much stuff. And I think it'd be interesting to have more videos or movies on TV that were more like documentaries that talked about uh, what goth is and uh, maybe if we had maybe if there was some uh, more maybe if there were some amateur filmers out there uh, maybe they could do a little documentary about goth and put on the TV but lately there hasn't been a documentary done by a news crew or anything like that it's just been really kind of put into the dark. I mean, I remember in, when it, when I, well, I remember when I was young, I watched two or three little, uh, documentaries about goths and, uh, 
Levite and not in Levita. Well, in Colorado, um, uh, beyond that, there's not really much on there. And I think people, it's an interesting subject enough that I think other people might be interested in. Right now, I'm listening to Alice Cooper, uh, P. My Frankenstein. And really, YouTube is really awesome for having all these great videos on it. I have a whole bunch of stuff on there. I have some ICP, I have some corn, I have Emily Autumn, I have Alice Cooper, I have um, Angel Spit, which I must thank my, fre my uh, friend at El Fuzzy Films. He is really great. Uh, he has a new video up, so if you're interested, you can go watch that. Um, and thumbs up to him. He's doing real great. He has a lot. He has a whole lot of views for all his videos, and uh, I commented on his new video. So if you run into his new video, uh, you might notice I was the first one to comment on it because I am subscribed to him and I regularly check my subscriptions when I get on here. Um, I do have a like. <laughs> That's a stupid thing to say, but um, I really do have a life. I have a life outside of this house and outside of YouTube. Uh, I do do a whole lot of manual labor and stuff like that. Uh, well, I just gave you a lot of information about me. Maybe I shouldn't do that. Um, I noticed that my video, Corn Cob, with me smoking a corn cob pipe, and just so you know, it was cigarette tobacco. It wasn't, it wasn't the Mary Jane or what you're thinking, it, what you might think it is. Although, when I, when I sell those things, I recommend people not to use them for what I think they're going to use them for but um, I've already uh, got one I've already given one to my granddad and he likes it and yes they are handmade they're made with uh, this bamboo piece right here not this one this is my cane this bamboo piece right here and I can actually I'll be right back I'll go get you one. 